Shalom, Shalom, early morning, impromptu, to the spirit. You know, another day in Babylon is just another day closer to the return of our Lord, Yahweh Shai. And he is close, brothers. You can feel him. We can feel it. Call Lord Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai. And um, this is not going to be too long. just want to just address the whoredom, you know, and the... Uh, wicked spirit of uh of eve man you know and that's why the lord is going to destroy these bitches man because what you're seeing right now is a f uh <clears throat> what you're seeing right now so i can let me lower this you're seeing right now is a filthy beast of a woman you know you know you can consider a woman this is a beast you're seeing right here all right and um, this woman has two husbands and is ready for a third. All right. This woman is a demonic filth of a woman. And, you know, women like this, the Heavenly Father is going to preserve for Jacob's trouble. All right. And, and the simple minded as ninjas of these men, you're going to listen to them, man. And that's why Yahweh Bashem Yahweh is, ha he's going to have to. We need, we need these people purge through fire. The Lord uh, has to bring that pain, you know. He, he's going to have to. Matter of fact, let me get second Ezra's real quick. Put it on deck real quick. <clears throat> let me see. Uh... Okay, let me get that real quick and let's play this video. Listen to this beast, this filth. My name is Kenya. This is Carl, my husband of 26 years. And this is Tiger, my husband of 10 years. Look at this. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. <laughs> Every lady should have two husbands. In the 12th year of our marriage, Carl and I decided that I was going to have multiple partners because I had met and fallen for another guy. So. I came back and reported that to Carl. So we decided to talk about it. Like, what do we do? How do we go about this? And that began a two-year journey of Kenya and I just kind of discussing things. We just had to figure things out. So we discussed it for a number of years. I finally came into the knowledge and understanding about feminine, you know, expression and realized you have to allow women to be free and express themselves. And as a man, I need to support her in doing that. You see, this is why the Heavenly Father is going to destroy these men and these women. These people got to be destroyed, man. All right? He, he made a statement, we have to allow our women to be free, right? Well, let's see what the scripture said about letting your women go free. Sirach 26 and 10, if thy daughter be shameless, keep her in straightly, lest she abuse herself through overmuch liberty. And this filth, she has... You know, just the fact that she went and had the freedom and liberty to go out and um, commit adultery, man. The Lord going to have to destroy these men and these women, man. Watch over an impudent eye and marvel not if she trespass against thee. She will open her mouth as a thirsty traveler when he have found a fountain and drink of every water near her. By every hedge would she sit down and open her quiver against every arrow, man. A whore. A whore, man. The Lord is going to destroy you wicked filth of a woman. And I cannot wait till the Lord bring pain to you mother efforts, man. Second Ezra chapter 8, verse 50. For many great miseries shall be done to them in the latter time. In the latter time should dwell in the world. Salaka. So like, For many great miseries shall be done to them that in the latter time should dwell in the world because they have walked in great pride. All right? And um, verse 53, let me jump down. For the root of evil is sealed up from you. Right? And that's what's coming. Pain, man. Death and pain where we at it ain't come up it's all good 
bear with me, brothers. If not, it's all good. <clears throat> well, I'm probably past it already. Hold on. Here we go. Second edge is nine. Where should I start? Verse 8, shall, shall be preserved from the sad perils. No, let me see. Yeah, this is, um. and everyone that shall be saved and, and shall be able to escape by his works and by faith, whereby ye have believed. And the, um, you know, this is going to be the true believers, the elect, enduring to the end. You know, Abaratazah, Yahabashim, Yahabashah, the Lord have mercy on me, man. And I can make it to the end. Uh, shall be preserved from the sad perils. See, there's there's sad perils wait, awaiting you, wicked Israelites, and shall see my salvation in my land and within my borders, for I have sanctified them from me from the beginning. Then shall there be in a pitiful case which now have abused my ways, and they that have cast them away despitefully shall dwell in torments. For such as in their life have received benefits and have not known me. And they that have loathed my law. This is what she's done. These, these wicked, this filth of a beast, of a woman, you know, has, has, has loathed the law of the Heavenly Father and these simple as men. You know? Man. <clears throat> While they had yet liberty, and when as yet place of repentance was open unto and understood not, but despised it, the same must know it after death and pain, man. And that's what's coming for you, you filth of a woman. That's why, look, man, listen to, uh, and I, I had to add this, you know, right here. Listen to this. I've been feeling... For the last year, I'm sick. If y'all don't know who I'm sick of, I'll just wear it. <laughs> <laughs> so, man, I'm sick of you bitches. Sis, if you can't see my sign. <laughs> and if you want, I'll flip it over. You tender ass niggas. <laughs> I'm sick of both of y'all. You tender ass niggas. And I'm sick of you bitches. <laughs> so, I just bought that in case you ain't know why. Yeah. Yeah. Yup. And this is what you see right here. My name is Kenya. Tender ass this is ninjas. And, 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 a, and a filth of a woman, man. Sirach 26. Let me jump down to verse 22. Where is that? Yup. And harlot shall be accounted as spittle. But a married woman is a tower against death to her husband. A wicked woman is given as a portion to a wicked man, but a godly woman is given to him that fear of the Lord, man. Verse 25, a shameless woman shall be counted as a dog, but she that is shamefaced will fear the Lord, man. May the Most High Yahabashim Yahushai come soon and bring that terror upon these people, man. Shalom.